Hi guys and welcome back to Archie Hamilton Racing and welcome back to another drag race video. We're on the airfield on a cold freezing winter's morning but we've got a great video for you today because what we have right here is we have the all new 2023 V8 Range Rover Sport, something which I keep on talking about but we have the only one in the country because you can't even order this car yet but today we're going to get a chance to see just how fast this V8 really is. Um, we're going to have a lot of fun. I don't. I have no idea what's going to happen, but uh, I'm sure it's going to surprise us all. It's a great bit of kit. And what we have next to us is the G63 AMG. This is from EV Hire. These guys are absolute legends. I'll leave all their details down below if you're interested in renting a car, etc. from those guys. They're really, really cool. But the G63 is not a slow car. This car competed with the X5M and others as well and is known to really be fast. So what we're going to do is the first race is put the G63 up against the Range Rover Sport V8 2023. So let's jump in, let's get cracking. Okay, you join me in the Range Rover Sport V8 2023 and uh, we're just about to get things uh, underway. I'm looking forward to it. I don't really know what's gonna happen. All I know is this is a quick bit of kit. I've gone up the Goodwood Hill climb in it. Um, it's the only one in the country. So we just, we generally have no idea. It's a world's first putting this up against anything. Um, so yeah, we're, ju we're just gonna see. Um, obviously today we're going up against the G63, which actually competes against the X5M. They're a lot quicker than you think. Um, so yeah, we're not really sure where this is gonna stand. I've got DSC off. It's literally just going to be a foot on the brake and go job. Um, it's a little bit icy where we are. It's going to basically test the car on traction and we're also going to do rolling starts uh, on this as well. So uh, it's going to be fun. But uh, what we're going to do is we're going to roll up to the line uh, for run number one to see if we can take down the G63 AMG. I'm pretty confident. Okay, we are good to go then in the G-Wagon. Are you, uh, you ready to go? I guess I'm just going to put my foot down. As soon as you say 3G1, let's do it. Uh, but hopefully the V8 will stand up. The G-Wagon is seriously fast, competes with the X5M. Who's your money on? V8. <laughs> and we don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Okay, so we do 3, 2, 1, and then we go. All right? Okay, here we go. Here we go. 3, 2, 1, go. Come on, V8, we're pulling away. Come on, whoa, we're gonna win. We're pulling away more. We hit fifth gear and we pull the gap. Come on. <laughs> yes, come on. Yes, I knew this wouldn't disappoint. We're not even in the SBR. I've even lost my radio, I'm that excited. Unreal. <laughs> not even the SBR, mate. It's just the V8. But I tell you what, the launch is quite similar, but then this hits fifth gear and it's like, woof. It moves slightly, I feel like sticks better to the ground. So you got a better launch than this. This kind of just squats back. I mean, the G63, you might not think is a quick car, but it does compete with the X5M in drag races. It's close. It's not miles and miles quicker, but I think when we start hitting fifth, sixth gear, I just saw you s this pulling. That's where it got into its own. Okay, what we're doing now is we're gonna do another launch control. We've done one and the V8 is winning, and that is a, a great surprise to us all. I think it is anyway. Um, we didn't really know, but anyway. Uh, we're going to do one more run and then after that we're going to go into rolling start so hopefully we can repeat what we just did just there so we're ready okay here we go okay three two one go oh you jumped the start there it's all right it's all right come on oh it's close it's closer i'm a nose ahead I'm a nose ahead. Come on! I'm going to beat him on the line. Yes! <laughs> that was intense. Yeah, I think 
think I just got you, you know? <laughs> no, you didn't. You <laughs> didn't. I got you. No, but not by much. The second one was much closer. <laughs> I think that was so close. You first will jump the start, I reckon. <laughs> no, I don't know if you did or not. We'll action replay it now. But that was close. I had to make sure every gear shift was perfect. We'll have an action replay on the line and then we'll be able to see specifically what that was. But I think the SVR was a wheel ahead, maybe not even, not even. That was good. That was good. But we're 2 0 up. I, I don't even need to see the replay. I, I know I won that one. The G60 gets going. It comes into his own. Well, yeah, funny you say that, because obviously what we do now is we do rolling start. So maybe now um, we'll see a little bit of a different result. I don't know, but it's uh, we might see a different result because rolling start, we eliminate the launch control. So that's what we're going to do now. It's time to take the cars up to the line for the rolling start. It should be interesting. I think uh, this is going to be interesting. Well, I mean, this is one on both launch controls, but I don't really know what's going to happen now. Fingers, fingers crossed. Right, let's get cracking. All right, uh, I'm going to go second gear and then we'll go, all right? Right, are we ready? We'll keep the speed the same, 30 miles an hour, and we get there, we'll go, right? Here we go. 80 miles an hour, 20, 25, hold it there, 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 go! Oh no, I didn't get, no! Come on! Come on, reel it back in, come on! Come on! Come on, V8! No, the start cost me! Come on! The lag on the start, I think, cost me. That was a clear win for me. <laughs> it wasn't a clear win. Over the line there. Ooh. The lag on, I tell you what, it was the lag. I, I didn't predict that when I hit second, it was just a bit of a delay. And that was probably, but I was coming for you fast. Oh, I tell you what, what race. So when I got my foot down on the start, it was like I needed to preempt it a little bit quicker. And obviously the throttle on the G-Wagon is more instant. So you got that initial launch, obviously, as we can see. But once I got going, I was coming. And that was like, yeah, just a bit too late. So anyway, either way, I'm really impressed with this G with the G-Wagon, with this V8. It's, uh, like I say, this is not the even the SVR version and it is quick. So there we go. What an epic race that was, the Range Rover Sports, winning the first two launch controls, which was seriously close as well. I'm amazed it's even competing with the G63. It really surprised me. Uh, the first race, I think I won by a couple of car lengths-ish, and the second one was by like maybe an inch. And then on the, on the rolling start, I just didn't quite get um, the launch off. Just I didn't preempt it enough. And uh, I was catching the G63. If we went for a little bit longer, it would have caught it, uh, but it was just a little too late. But it just has amazed me in all sorts of ways, the V8. It's, uh, it's quick, it uh, gets amazing launch control, and it just keeps going. It's really, really uh, streamlined as well. But to even compete with the G63 yeah, was great. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, huge thanks to EV Hire once again for bringing down uh, the G63. I'll leave their details down below. And also the driver of the G63, Elements Desserts. They're going to be in the description as well. So go check them out as well. And yeah, we'll think of some more races which we've got coming up. We need to race some V8 more, don't we? It's just good. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't subscribe. See you very soon. Thank you.